My name is Anna Svedrup Tigesson. I'm a biology professor and also an author. Uh, and my fourth book is called On the Shoulders of Nature, How 10 Million Species Save Your Life. And I'd like to read you a, a passage called The Whale Fall. Picture yourself floating in cold salt water, pitch darkness all around. Somewhere beneath you lie desolate stretches of ocean bed. Tons of water above you create, create immense pressure, as if you had a stack of fully grown elephants standing on your head. Welcome to the deep sea, the inhospitable habitat stretching from 200 to 11,000 meters below the surface of the ocean. Sometimes it snows down here, snow that never melts, marine snow, tiny flakes of dead organisms from the layers of water above, which provide much needed food for life in the deeps. Once in a blue moon, something truly titanic descends from above, a dead whale. We call it a whale fall. The very words make my brain tingle. In my mind's eye, I picture a vast mountain of flesh and blubber and bone sinking slowly, majestically through the water masses. Tons of carbon, nitrogen, calcium, phosphorus taking life's last dive. I don't know how long it takes for a dead whale to sink to its final resting place, but between the moment it lands and the point when every trace has vanished, we're talking decades. Food is in limited supply on the ocean bed, and the gaps in time and space between potential meals are large. A whale fall in the deep sea is like a lavish hotel buffet in the middle of a desolate desert. The whale becomes a hotspot for a strange, and to some extent unknown, diversity of species that slowly, slowly recycles the nutrients of the dead animal back into the circle of life. Thank you, and if you like to read more, it's all in here. <laughs>